Hi, I'm Brian Van from SportBikeTrackYear.com, and today we're going to do a product review on the Dynes Avro C2 leather jacket, six forty nine ninety five. Available in Euro sizes, forty four through sixty. Multiple colorways are available. Please look to our website, SportBikeTrackYear.com, to see images of each and every color. Let's talk sizing right now. I'm five feet eleven inches tall, two hundred seven pounds. 34 inch waist with a somewhat athletic build. I'm wearing a size 54 euro right now in the Avro leather jacket. The fit and feel is exactly as I would expect. A note on that, this jacket comes with a full quilted body warming liner, right? Sleeves and vest. That takes up a lot of space in the jacket. When you're choosing the size, of a jacket like this, you need to think about when am I going to ride in this? Am I going to ride in it mostly when it's hot out without the liner in it? Or do I think I'll be using it more in the cooler seasons with the liner in it? Because the liner really influences the fit. For me, I'm a fair weather rider. I ride more when it's hot. So I'm going to want this thing to fit perfect when it's hot out, which it does right now when I have that liner removed. I put the liner in, it adds a little bulk, it tightens the jacket up a little bit, but it would still be appropriate for me. But for me, most importantly, it's going to fit perfect when I have the liner removed. So just bear that in mind when you're choosing the right size for yourself. Remember, we've eliminated restocking fees here at STG. If you get the jacket and the fit doesn't meet your expectations, no restocking fees. Just follow a couple simple rules outlined on the site. We've got a very convenient return and exchange form hosted online. Or you can call any one of our staff members to arrange for an RMA. We'll turn it around quick. Remember, free shipping over $40 to the lower 48 United States with really affordable international shipping rates. Let's focus on this jacket. Now, this is another one of Dynase's signature high-end pieces. When you get the Avro, okay, you slide your arms into it, you zip up, you know you've got something special. It is on a different plane as compared to the majority of the other manufacturers out there. It looks special. It feels special. It is special. No doubt about it. This jacket's going to be appropriate for, obviously, sport bike riding, right? It's going to be good for cool all the way in to hot weather riding. That sweet liner that comes in there is not only have an insulating property, but will also work to block the wind. The jacket offers some localized perforation, right? Anywhere where you see these raised portions where it's perforated, there's energy absorbing foam behind that for safety, but they perforate through the leather and through the foam, so that's gonna flow air. All of this S1 stretch fabric, right? Very high-end abrasion and tear resistant fabric. This all flows air freely. You'll see it spans from the forearm all the way up into the neck area, right? Flows there freely in the underarm areas as well. Perforations here, and there are some more perforated panels on the back. So on the surface, this jacket might look like it's not gonna move a lot of air, but it does largely due to the generous use of that stretch fabric. The other thing the stretch fabric does for you is it takes the mobility of this jacket and it really amps it up. This thing moves with you like a second skin. As I said earlier, you slide your arms into this, you're going to know you've got something special immediately. For the cuff, we've got locking zipper. They finished this in leather. I've said it before, that's the sign of a true high-end garment. You zip the cuff up, you tidy it up with a little bit of leather and Velcro. We've got excellent high-end leather, CE certified armor in the elbows, forearms, as well as shoulders. The jacket has the ability to accept the Dynes chest protector, slides right into a zippered pocket in the front of the coat. It also can accept the CE certified Dynes back protectors, either the G1 or G2 sizes. Several options to choose from there. Look to the Dynes armor section on our website. If you need any help choosing the right one for your application, never hesitate to contact our staff. We'll walk you through it and get you taken care of quickly. Volume adjustment in the waist is managed right here with leather, velcro, and a metal D-ring. We've got zippered hand warmer storage pockets.
They do the zipper in such a way that the zipper pull is actually hidden inside the leather flap. It gives it a real clean, sporty look. Full zip to pants attachment. You want to pair this with one of the Dyna's leather riding pants. You can have yourself a great two-piece riding suit for the street or if you want to do some track days in it. If you like what you've seen so far, and I can't imagine that you didn't, you want some more information, stay tuned for the second part. We'll give you a look from the inside out of this incredible leather jacket. Okay, here we go, the Avril leather jacket from the inside out. That removable quilted liner that I spoke about earlier in the video, nice high-end piece. You can see it's got a, a knitted cuff, multiple attachment points. It's this Valtherm insulation, high-end stuff. And remember, this liner also has a bit of a wind blocking property to it as well to help shut off the ventilation and allow you to use this jacket when it's cooler and cold out to increase the seasonality. It comes with CE certified armor in the elbows, forearms, and shoulders. It's not removable, we'll talk about that more in a second. This jacket has the ability to accept the Dyna's chest protection, right? It's a low profile CE certified chest plate with a hard outer shell. It's available in the, not, or, I'm sorry, in the Dyna's armor section of our site. To install the coat, all you do is open up this zipper that's built into the jacket. You see it's got a pocket to hold the, the uh, chest protector. It slides right in the pocket like so. You'll go ahead from there and stretch over the fabric. That just helps to hold it in place. You zip up the coat and you've got MotoGP race level chest protection in this leather jacket. Also, the coat is able to accept either G1 or G2 back protection. There is a pocket right here. You zip it open. There are are two pockets inside there, one for the G1 shape, one for the G2 shape. Multiple options are available. Here is the Wave CE certified piece. Here is the Manus, right? Very uber protective, high-end piece, great match. Either one's a great match for that chest protector. Takes the safety of this jacket and puts it right through the roof. High-end leather, it's got a great hand to it. Dyna's logo done with leather and reflectives. That's a really cool look from the back. We're using the S1 fabric here in the neck area. It's a hot spot, helps keep you cool. Large perforated panel here. There's energy absorbing foam stitched behind it. Remember they perforate through everything. Dyna's logo in leather stitched over. Large S1 stretch fabric panel here on the back of the shoulder. It really enhances the mobility. This makes the jacket feel like it's a second skin. Volume adjuster here in the waist. Zippered storage pockets, hand warmer style. Locking zippers, lined pockets. And like I said earlier, I like how they did this too. They really hide the zipper pull. It gives it a clean, racy look. Composite CE certified shoulder protectors. We've got a molded protector with leather stretched over the top. Got that famous Dyna's metal plate. There's energy absorbing foam on the inside. All these pieces come together for a very protective shoulder plate. Some energy absorbing foam here. It's perforated stitched to the leather. Embossed Dyna's logo. Traditional Dyna's logo stitched over in leather. Huge panel of S1 fabric. I already showed you the cuff. Get to the front of the jacket. More perforation here top and bottom. You get inside, you can see that chest protector pocket. There's a really nice mesh liner on the inside of the jacket. It's got a sanitized liner. This stuff feels great against the skin. Full circumference, zip to pants. You put this and pair it with any one of the Dyna's leather pants. You got yourself a great two-piece riding suit for the street or even for some track day duty. You get inside the jacket here too under the S1 fabric here in this area to really enhance the comfort and the cooling, they've got a nice spacer fabric, a 3D spacer fabric. It maintains that pocket of air and helps to enhance the comfort and the airflow. Got a zippered storage pocket here, left side of the jacket, great place to store things that you want to keep safe. The back protector pocket, as I showed you earlier, is right here. What do I think of this jacket? I think if you've watched this video, it's very clear. I'm a huge fan of this jacket. I love this jacket. I love the way it looks. We've sold tons of these. 
there are many, many very happy Avro leather jacket riders out there from Dine's. It's a good value at $6.49.